So in this video, we're going to be iterating through each individual lesson here. So before we get started, I'm going to go ahead and import the link from Inertia because we're going to be using that to switch between lessons. So let's go in and have a V4 lesson in lessons. And let's go ahead and make sure we have this link here. And then here, you just want to have lesson for now and just see what we get out. So if we go back in here now, we have uh, in here, for example, title, exam one. So we just want to go ahead and output lesson, the title for now. And we got example one there. Perfect. And if we go ahead and just see what other data we could actually use in here as well. So we have a lot of updates here. So we have the duration. And before we go ahead and import icons up now, just gonna have in lesson the duration like this. Yeah. And what we actually want to go ahead and do later on down the line is inside the lesson resource, we want to automatically determine if this is minutes, hours, and so on. So we're basically going to prefix this and later on end this with for example minutes or one hour and ten minute and so on. So we're going to automatically do that calculation later down the line but for now I'm just going to put the duration in here and assume that the duration is only going to be displayed in minutes for the time being. But if we look outside of that then that's kind of the most important thing we need for this. Um, over the next few videos, we can basically be working on perfecting this sidebar along with displaying the actual content of a lesson. And that will actually be all for this video. Thank you very much for watching it, and I'll see you in the next tutorial.